High resolution displays are at the heart of modern consumer electronics, ranging from mobile devices to 4K ultra high definition televisions. In addition, certain emerging technologies will require even higher resolutions. We propose a solution to meet these requirements using existing display technologies. A pair of spatial light modulators is stacked on top of one another, subject to a sub-pixel lateral displacement. By optimizing the patterns displayed on these multiplicative layers, cascaded displays appear with enhanced resolution. We emphasize that prior super-resolution displays primarily exploit additive rather than multiplicative superpositions. Cascaded displays present higher quality imagery using a single frame. With the addition of multiple frames, image quality significantly exceeds prior designs. Here we show a high resolution target image and a low resolution version. A cascaded display using two time frames achieves high fidelity reproduction. Here we show the underlying layers. In practice, even a single frame provides significant enhancement. Looking closer, the benefits over additive super resolution become apparent. Notice the elimination of artifacts in the E and F letters. Cascaded displays can be extended to achieve spatiotemporal super-resolution by staggering the refreshes of the two layers. A target video is shown refreshing at 10 frames per second and at 5 frames per second. The layers on a cascaded display multiply together to create the appearance of a 10 frames per second display. Notice the smoother motion achieved using cascaded displays. We construct a prototype using a pair of off-the-shelf LCD panels. The backlight is removed from one of these panels. A 3D printed enclosure holds the components shown here. The interface boards are screwed to a plate with one LCD mounted on top. A quarter wave retarding film is affixed and the second panel is arranged to achieve a cascaded display. To allow head-mounted display, an inertial measurement unit is mounted to the rear case and a lens attachment is affixed to the front. Here we show spatial super-resolution results for still images. Notice the enhanced details in the feathers on the right. Similarly, compare the sharpness of the forehead. The prototype also supports spatiotemporal super-resolution. The same sequence from earlier is shown, now captured using a video camera to record the cascaded display. Here we show a user interacting with the prototype. Note that this head-tracked stereoscopic imagery is generated in real time. The rendered frames produced by our interactive demonstration are shown here. Note the improved legibility of the text on the right. Here we show the two display layers. We emphasize that this imagery was produced in real time using our GPU accelerated factorization algorithm. This is the same sequence, now recorded by a video camera looking through the head-mounted display optics.
Artifacts in the periphery are due to errors introduced by our calibration procedure. However, super resolution benefits are clearly visible in the center. A second prototype was constructed to explore applications of cascaded displays to digital projection. A pair of Pico projectors were disassembled, providing an affordable source for a pair of liquid crystal on silicon, or LCOS micro displays. The projectors were mounted on an optical breadboard. A relay lens projects the image from the first LCOS onto the second. A polarizing beam splitter and a projection lens transfer the dual modulated image to a screen surface. Experimental results for the cascaded LCOS projector confirm spatial super resolution. As discussed in the paper, radiometric artifacts are introduced due to synchronization errors between the two micro displays. In conclusion, cascaded displays present a new opportunity to meet the demands posed by ultra-high definition standards and beyond using today's display technologies.